What's up, y'all? This is Yashu. I'm out here just taking a walk right now. This coronavirus thing is insane. It's got people acting stupid. More than stupid, I think, acting afraid. I'm in a nature park right now, just, you know, cruising around, walking, and there's nobody out here. Because everybody's afraid. But then, you know, not everybody. <laughs> I just really want to tell you, like, don't be so scared at, you know, media published things like they exaggerate everything for real you know and yeah there is people dying from it all respect to them and to their families but people die from everything every year every day more people have died from the flu this year than coronavirus don't be so scared all right don't be so scared you ain't got nothing to be scared of as long as you're like not touching on your face and you know, rubbing your nose and whatnot, you know, without washing your hands and stuff. You, like you, man, have nothing to worry about at all. If you're an elderly person watching this or a very young person watching this, you know, or anybody with some kind of like autoimmune deficiency or something like that, then I would just say, you know, you be a little extra cautious. You're, if you're doing your social distancing thing and washing your hands, you're doing your part, you're fine. I would love for y'all to use this time productively. I would love for y'all to grow during this time. There's people that are just in their houses, pretty much everybody right now, in their houses all day. And this stuff doesn't last forever. It blows over eventually. And when it does, I would love for you to be in a better situation than you were going into it. I would love for you to have gained some kind of self-awareness through this time, you know? You, you got nothing but time right now. Use it to explore yourself. Use it to learn, you know, what makes you tick, what makes you happy, you know. Try some meditation. Experiment with some meditation and stretching frequently, breathing deeply, randomly throughout the day, you know. Experiment with it. That what y'all hearing is a train right now. That's the train stopping cold for some reason right here. But anyway, use this time to, to, to make sure that you're better off when this is all over and not worse off. Use this time, y'all. Be grateful for everything in your life, for everyone in your life. I mean, you see, you know, how easily things can change. Fear makes things change even faster because people aren't irrational and thinking. They just do. They just react. I mean, I just want to tell y'all, like, if y'all are any kind of afraid right now, replace that fear with gratitude, yo. Acknowledge that, you know, yeah, maybe I'm afraid of losing my mom, right? Say, for instance, or my grandma or my grandpa, and I don't want them to get sick, you know, and, and lose them. If that's how you feel, then you should be calling them. You should be talking to them and letting them know how grateful you are for them to have them in your life in your world and the influence that they've had such a great one on you that you feel this way about them and don't take that for granted these things these times are reminders we're not supposed to be all defeated and discouraged and beaten down by it we're supposed to be empowered we're supposed to learn we're supposed to adapt we can do all those things it doesn't, it doesn't take anyone or any severe thing. It shouldn't. Y'all are grand, beautiful, and wonderful. Keep being that way. And use this time to spread love, yo. Not fear. If you're going to talk about this stuff on social media or whatever, spread love behind it. And, 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 and don't try to make more people more afraid. Try to make them comforted. Let them know that like we're in this together and everything is okay. Everything's going to be okay. You're at much less risk for something if you're not stressing, if you're not afraid, if you're laughing and smiling and joyful and like just feeling the good vibes, you fight off the bad vibes. And you might think a virus isn't a vibe, it isn't the same thing, but trust me, the vibes have so much to do with your body, your immune system, like the way your body handles invaders like viruses that try to come shut it down, try to come hurt it. Your feeling has much to do with, with your ability to fight off negativity in any form, including the form of a virus. So keep your smile, keep your faith, keep it strong, and know 
that you are safe, you are good. Give your praise and your thanks to the Most High for making sure that that's the case, for making sure that you're even able to see this right now. Because there are a lot of people who won't. They're in a much worse situation than you. And some of them are still happier. Believe that or not, it's crazy. Be thankful, yo. I'm thankful. I'm thankful for you. I'm thankful for us. I'm thankful that we have the strength to get through something like this better off than we went in. Okay.